Drake with Hold On, we're going home and it's playing right here on 88.2 San FM. It is the hit selector and I am Crystal. I'd like to welcome my guest right now on Celeb Select. That's Clayf here with us. Hello, hello. Hi, how you doing? Good, how are you? Please Good. give us a correct pronunciation of your second name because these days oh. people are very sensitive. Mm? Okay, I like it actually when people call me Chatu mm-hmm. because uh, it just means ours. But my name is Chatu Hire. Chatu means ours. Yeah, chatu. It means like uh, mm, chatu is like a chitu. Mm. It belongs to us. It's ours. So chatu hire is like what God has given us. It's oh. actually Emmanuel. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, welcome to the show. Thank you. We were, you were just saying before this is the first time this you and I is have like actually very first time. <laughs> I see what you're doing there. You know what I mean? It's okay. (laughs) Everyone can have a first time for whatever. (laughs) Whatever. But welcome to Celeb Select. Thank you so much. Okay, my dear. Um, A lot of people are excited that you're on this show. Mm -hmm. They want to hear your story. Mm -hmm. I think I'll start right now with just really quick. What are you doing right now? Since you're not up on our TV screens, what are you doing right now? Okay, so currently, um, um, I just opened up a company. I partnered with a friend of mine. Mm -hmm. And the company is called Get Quick Dubai. Okay. We deliver and we also do holiday pack- packages. Okay, okay. Yeah, so mm-hmm. anything you want to do in Dubai, we can do it for you. We can get it to you. Okay. And then I also have, um, I don't know if this is the moment, mm-hmm. but I have like um, a phone app coming up. Eh. Yeah. Okay, it's that a was a sales pitch. Yeah. <laughs> let's, let's go back, let's go back, let's go back. <laughs> so, Claith, where were you born? Um, I was born in Uganda. Okay. Are you Ugandan? Of course. Mm-hmm. You 101%. Need to check. <laughs> Your no. name, Claith. Yeah. I have to be honest, you're the only Claith I know. Thank I've, you so I've much. I've never come across that name before. Mm-hmm. Do you know any other Claiths out there? Uh, no, not any that I've met, mm-hmm. but I've seen some on Instagram. And of course, you know, when you're trying to find out the meaning of your name mm-hmm. as per social media or Google, and then there's somebody else that is called Claith. Did but your I'm parents not- ever tell you how they chose that name? Has it ever uh, come up? Actually, my name, my name is supposed to be Claith. Okay. But then it doesn't make sense. So it's just Claith. Mm. Mm. Blink, blink. What? What? <laughs> yeah, like. It's supposed to be? Yeah, like K L E E. Oh. Yeah, but it's K L I E. Mm. Yeah. Because, you know, when you're trying to pronounce it, it, it has a different pronunciation and a different spelling as well. So mm-hmm. it's just Claith. Okay. Okay. Yeah, but uh, my name is Chatire, mm-hmm. Kathy, mm-hmm. Claith. Okay. Not Catherine. Not Catherine. Yes. Kathy. We need to be clear <laughs> about this. Yeah. But <laughs> well, you can call me Chatu any day, anytime. It sounds like you like Chatu. I Is love it. it. I, your, your friends call you that? People who know you from back in the day? Or... Is that what you want to go with now? Yeah, I feel like I feel like when you call me Chatu, you're very comfortable with me. Okay. And Claith, Claith, Claith. Hey, yeah. Chatu. <laughs> <laughs> For the rest of this interview. <laughs> so you were saying you're born in Uganda? Yeah. Where were you born? I was born in um, in Zambia. Mm-hmm. But I didn't grow up in Zambia. Okay. I majorly grew up in on, on, along in Tebe Road. Mm. Not until when I was about um, nine years old is when we moved to Mutungo, okay. Lozira. So. Mm-hmm. Then from then on is when now, you know, okay, growing up started for me. Okay. Yeah. And where did you go to school? I went to a couple of schools. You know, sometimes <laughs> I meet people and someone is like, hi, Cliff. I'm like, hi. Then after I'm like, no, we're going to meeting. I'm going, where did we meet? <laughs> My mom actually likes to call me a male of schools. I went to a couple of schools. I went to City Parents. Mm. I went to, um, for primary school. This is where I finished. I went to St. Mary's Chitende. And then at a point, I went to Nalia. But in between there, I used to go to schools for like one term. And then I come back. Yeah. Why? Because... I was just not comfortable in the schools that I went to. Mm. I, uh, I'm, I'm so much, I, I think I'm so much of a home person, a mommy's girl, that boarding school just didn't treat me so well, that, that I would just keep trying so many different schools. Oh, so every time you went to a, so you went boarding school? Mm. Even in private? No, no, Starting not from my S1. S1, okay. Yeah. Uh-huh. Mm. And you just wouldn't like it? You no, I didn't. You were comfortable, so you try another place. I was home like every two weeks. I was either sick or I had lost something. I always had a, an excuse to come back from school so I can be at home. Well, you mentioned that you're a mommy's girl. Yes. So are you number one? How many kids are you? <laughs> no, I'm actually from a family of eight. Mm-hmm. And I come number four. Number four. Yeah. Okay. So well, that's a big family. Mm, it's a huge family. I, I think that explains the reason as to why I have a small circle of friends. Okay. Because... I just have a lot of family that I don't have time <laughs> to meet friends and all that, you know? Mm-hmm. Yeah, so. Okay. That, yeah. 